TFNN. Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Hi, folks. This is Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour at noon Eastern Time each day. I'm here for the for the 10 o'clock a.m. update. Straight off this, you'll have the uh, binary, uh, the bull bear binary option hour with Tom and Tommy. But in the meantime, the Dow is up 73 at 25,698. Uh, a nice rebound from the low, the, the rising lows of the last three days. But it is also making lower highs. So we're going to watch this closely. Uh, to give you parameters right now, 25,696 up 70. If the Dow gets to up 110 and holds a, a plus 60s or more between 110 this afternoon Eastern Time and 220, I would say that would be uh, you'd be likely to have a good close. If there is a give back and you're only up like 20 points or something by the we've seen this happen intraday for the past few days. Opening early rally, I have a te technical indicator that said there should be a 9 to 11 point E mini rally overnight into today that would help the market. When that wears out, you've got to be careful. So right now, the, the, the parameters to look at are very simple. Dow up about 60 at between 110 and 220 this afternoon. That's a positive. Uh, the S&P has to be, be up about 8, and right now the S&P is up 7.43. So it needs to be up at least six, but I would say eight, because if it's only up two or three points and the Dow is only up about 20, or you give back and you, the, the market's negative, that would not be good going into tomorrow, the last day of the month. There should be some buying. So we're looking at that. The VIX index as well. The VIX index, oh, let me just do this and forget about the VIX, because the VIX is up. Uh, uh, no, it's down a little bit, but I, I really want to just show you the QQQ is very important. The NDX 100 trading vehicle up 55 if at 178.50, if this, if the Qs are up about a point at that particular hour, so about 110 to 220, that would be good. But it really needs to be a lot higher to be able to regain the strength that it had a week and a half ago. I think it's starting to fail. The technicals are failing. And at any point in the next three days, you see the QQQ is under 176. That's going to be a problem as far as I'm concerned. The weekly charts all around are still very strong. So it would be shorter time. We either use time or we use price and we consolidate. That's kind of the way I'm looking at the, at the market at this point. Stay tuned. We've got Tom and Tommy coming up. Then you've got Think or Swim. Then you've got my show, The Tiger Conditions Hour. Steve Rhodes, Dave White, and Tom O'Brien. Have a great day.